This is a guided meditation for the new moon in June. So we've been waiting all year to say that one, haven't we? And welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, I post guided meditations every week and also on the new moon and full moon and other interesting stuff as well. So please join me and subscribe if you haven't already. And why do we meditate when it's the new moon? Well, at the full moon and the new moon, the energy of the moon is the strongest. And we can see that in the tides. If like myself, you live near the sea, the tides, they come in further and go out further because the magnetic pull of the moon is stronger. And for many hundreds, thousands of years in all spiritual traditions, they honour the phases of the moon and use it to plant new crops and all kinds of things recognizing that we're all connected we're all one so even though we're not may not be consciously aware of it the the moon affects us too because our bodies are mostly water so in this guided meditation this is an opportunity for you to practice some letting go of any beliefs or uh, that you have about yourself the world and get beyond that ego mind and connect with your higher self your higher wisdom your spirit guides and really use that for maybe setting some intentions or just being open to receiving divine guidance about whatever you need to hear or, or you Maybe you've got a specific question on something you'd like to ask and just let it go and have faith that the answer will come. Maybe not in the way you expect or when you expect, but if I've learned over the years um, that faith is just so important when things appear to be going wrong and everything in the outer world doesn't seem to be going my way I just have to come back and to that sense of faith that whatever I need will will come when I need it so get into a comfortable position turn off any distractions and of course if you need to you can pause the video while you do that if you want to grab a notebook to do some journaling afterwards about anything that comes up or just do some free writing while you're sort of connected to your higher self you're in that sort of more relaxed open brainwave state because meditation that's what happens it opens us up to receiving and being more open and these meditations are just channeled so whatever comes to me we just have faith that that's what what is needed right now in the world So if you wish, when you're in a comfortable position, you may close your eyes. And start by feeling the ground underneath you. It's important to remain grounded throughout this meditation so we have that balance between the support of the earth and the guidance from our higher selves. And just allowing your body to relax and settle. Notice the movement of the breath. If there's any thoughts coming up, 
notice what they are but don't get caught up in the stories let them come and go while you keep your awareness on the connection with the earth and the breath And if you want, you can rest your hands on your lap with the palms facing upwards in a receptive posture. And now imagine as you breathe that you're breathing in and out through every pore of your skin. And as you do this, you feel the body becoming lighter, more open, breathing away any tension or stuck energy being in the flow and connected to everything and everyone throughout all time and space. And as you do so, you might lose the sense of your physical body and any boundaries of your physical body. Just feeling the space within and without. At one with the universe. And you are the universe. And within that universe is the moon, the new moon. Sometimes barely visible, its energy can still be felt. each breath your body is becoming lighter, almost dissolving into the air. And you might have a, a floating sense. Just having faith that you're always supported. And you might feel the support of your guides. While you're open to receiving. And the more you let go of any beliefs and thoughts. Feel more at peace, at one, and realising there's nothing to do, there's nowhere to go. You're already whole and perfect. And this physical body is not who you are. And if you want, you can imagine the physical body just dissolving 
floating away. And you're here, present in your divine essence. Shining like a star, radiant. Relaxing with each breath, letting go, becoming lighter, feeling all the negative thoughts and emotions just dissolving away as your light shines brighter. And you become more and more of your true self, which is love. And you can imagine those negative energies and emotions of fear, and anger, and hate, the things that perpetuate the illusion that we're separate. They're just dropping away like shackles, floating off into the, dis into the distance. And you become freer and lighter like a bird to go wherever you want. You're not restricted anymore by this physical body. Pure consciousness. Perhaps you can imagine it's like a mist floating around, changing shape, changing colour, texture. Allowing you to shape shift into whoever or whatever you want to be. There's no limit to your consciousness and your imagination. And any time you want, you can come back and reconnect. And letting go of any illusions about who you really are. And now just rest in that awareness consciousness feeling the bliss of being alive vibrant energy transcending any physical limitations either real or imagined embracing that sense of possibility 
limitless options. You have a choice. Always have a choice of how you respond in any moment. Setting the intention that in future, your higher self, your consciousness, is the one that takes charge and not the ego. Thank the ego for keeping you safe, but it's no longer needed. you want you can take some deeper breaths and feeling that energy body just expanding more with each in breath and breathing out love with each out breath and feeling the heart opening to receiving and giving love wherever you go and whoever you meet, you'll be doing it all from a place of love. Having faith, letting go, that your higher self always knows what's best, even if it sometimes doesn't make any sense to the rational mind. Letting go that a little bit more with each breath. And if you want, you can sit on for longer. Just pause this video. Being in that higher vibration sense of expanded consciousness breathing the universe in and breathing it out and remembering at all times that is who you really are Well, that didn't really, that wasn't what I was expecting at all. But thank you so much for joining me and meditating with me today. And as we expand our consciousness, our awareness, our vibration, and become more of who we are, our true essence, then that has such a profound effect on the world. And it doesn't even need everybody to do it because it will affect the people that we come into contact with. Do take care of yourself, take some time now to journal, maybe you want to drink some water, but don't go rushing into whatever you're doing next. Allow that to settle, to become absorbed into your consciousness. And of course you can come back and do this as often as you wish when you feel, oh, I need to get back in touch with my higher self. So do remember also to ground yourself as well. So feeling the chair, feeling your feet. If you want, you can rub them up and down. Because it's important to have that balance. Otherwise, you can become very spacey. 
and forget that we do actually do have a physical body as well. So until the next time, take care, go well and lots of love. <laughs>